Here we go. Here we go. Oh, no. Oh, yes, yeah, come back. Yeah. <laughs> Hello everybody, Chris please, and we're back with more deep, no time for BS. So, the game has had a pretty damn large update here. It's in beta. Well, part of it's in beta. You can play on the beta server, which is what I'm doing right now. We have two new animals that you can start off with. The blobfish and the worm. This game is fantastic for creating an amazing sense of self-worth. So, there's a new area now. It's called, I don't know, the deep ocean or the abyss? Whatever you want to call it. Uh, you can start there. Now, you're gonna notice if we go too high, as in if we're if we're in the shallow, so to speak, we begin taking damage. So as a worm, we want to be down here eating all of these delicious golden treasures. The deep seas here, or the abyss, or whatever you want to call it, is really neat. I actually really like the look of this place. We're gonna get to turn into a new critter in just a little bit. So there's several new creatures here that you can be. You see, now we're a king crab. For some reason, we're like an albino king crab. One of the, well, not one of, well, yeah, one of. One of the uh, creatures that are down here are called the anglerfish, and they are our mortal enemy. We do have to watch out for them. Hopefully there's not too many on right now. I really don't know. I know there's always, oh, God, okay, did you see that right there? Did you see that scumbag that just came after us? That was an angler. Jesus, there's a friggin' worm popping out of nowhere. So the worms are pretty tough, too. Uh, they're beginner critters. But they have surprisingly good attack. Like, I'm really impressed at how well they can whip your ass if you let them. But luckily, we're a freaking jellyfish, boys. Jellyfish don't have time for that bull crap. What we do have to do, though, is get the hell out of here. Because as a jellyfish, I mean, things are fine down here in the deep parts. But quite frankly, the anglerfish are pretty damn brutal. So if we can, and we should be able to right up here, let's GTFO in the greatest of ways. So, deep. It's all about being a troll, essentially. Yes, the game about screwing your fellow man over. Now, what is this over here? See that little critter right there? What could that mean? Well, I guess that's just a piece of food. I wasn't really 100% sure. Pretty cool how everything glows very, like, powerfully when you're in the deep area. So now we're back in the shallows. This is the part of deep that you're probably familiar with. The classic part of deep. The normal part of deep. And this is where we're going to spend quite a little bit of time. So not only is there a blobfish and a worm, although you don't really get to spend much time as either of them as you saw. The, the worm is, is probably the thing in the game that you spend the least time, like, ever. I guess if you wanted to, you could, like, forcefully spend time in it, but I don't know why you'd want to. We got a couple other things. We got a sea lion to finally keep the freaking penguins company. Thanks for that, developer. I remember the last time we played, I had said being a penguin was like an effort in futility. It made me, it made me seriously question my life's choices because there was nothing we could do. You just had to sit there and feel sorry for yourself because there was no one else to play with. Every once in a while, a giant ass whale or something would come over by you. Man, look, be, being a beaver is fantastic on this side of the board. Holy crap. There is, like, a metric ton of beaver dams. Uh, but anyway, yeah, every once in a while, like, a whale would come over and try and eat you, but there really wasn't much else. Like, that was legitimately it. Uh, and mostly you just kind of sat there and ate, and ate, I guess what is, well, I guess these are plankton. I'm still not 100% sure what in the hell the blue orbs were. I just called them, like, ice chunks or something. That's what penguins live off of. It's just water and frozen water, nothing really else. But... The thing I'm not really looking forward to is being a bird, but we're going to have to grind through that to try and get to the cool stuff that we haven't been yet. Like, if this game is all about being a troll, like, a bird is the ultimate troll. Like, you can't really do anything but, like, hop around on an island and give people the avian middle finger while eating berries and apples. And I, I don't, like, I don't know. I feel like there should be some, some amount of additional involvement in the ecosystem as the bird rather than eating all the fruit and shitting on everyone oh look a worm uh i'm gonna let him go i don't care that much about him so yeah this is life as a bottom feeder here as a squid oh look at the text on the on the lower right hand portion come young ones <laughs> it sounds like it sounds like rapacus the mighty trying to lure children into his van god almighty luckily you're never a squid for too long Although, if I take my eyes off my surroundings, this is where we're going to end up dying. We should turn into a bird next. Yep. Yay. My favorite freaking character. The bird. 
Oh, how happy I am. We don't have much oxygen, though, so let's pop on out of here, take a dump into the, the great blue, and head over to this lovely, this lovely land over here, where we're sharing now with another scumbag. Uh, I can't see his name from here. We got a couple of scumbag ducks that are just kind of fluttered around. No big deal. This is going to be super action-packed, guys. Super action-packed. So I think I'm going to try and, like, edit past most of this stadium. Maybe asking yourself, Gray, how's life as a seagull been treating you? Well, basically, I'm just trying to perfect my little clockwise motion here. See, I grab the apples on the trees, then I scooby-doo over here to the left, grabbing all the blueberries, and then I basically do this over and over and over again. This is what being a seagull is like. Although you'll notice our, uh, our experience is going pretty damn quick. When we have a nice island like this and we're uncontested, it's pretty damn good. I'm not going to lie. Also, one of the other updates in the game, which is quite, which is kind of nice, is that you're... Oh, shit. Okay. All right. This is interesting. Thank you, bird. Oh. Oh, yes. So now we're a ray. Yay. What we can do is smash our head into the ground and it hides us. So epic, epic points for that. Let's continue to get down here to the, not the deep area, but just to this area. Oh, see that right there? We're kind of going toward the deep. You don't want that, baby. Although, now more creatures can survive in the frozen area, which is really sweet. So, actually, let's go grab all this, too. From what I understand, supposedly the red gives you, uh, like, a little bit more XP than the rest of the stuff. Yeah, it definitely does. You can see there. When we were grabbing these over here, we weren't getting, like, solid chunks of experience in one shot, if you look at the numbers. But when we were grabbing the red things, we were going up in experience pretty quick. Anyway, over by the penguins, the ray is one of the creatures that can survive over there now, as is, uh, I don't remember, I think maybe the jellyfish? I'm not 100% sure. I think that there's three things over there that can survive besides the penguins. Maybe we'll head that way and see what's over there. With my luck, it's probably where all the freaking whales are. Whoa, look at this. I found like the plankton motherload over here, guys. I I'm waiting for the other shoe to drop. Oh God, see right there. You knew, you knew that a shark would be hanging out somewhere. That's fine though. We're gonna go, we're gonna go ahead and blast off to the great beyond. We're gonna grab some of these as well. You gotta be fucking kidding me. Fucking shark is right there after me. I can't believe this, what the hell? All right, I guess I'll head down this way. Now, remember, we do have the ability to smash our head into the ground and disappear should we need to. Oh, I think the shark finally gave it up. Well, thank you, douchebag. I shouldn't call him a douchebag. It's the circle of life. Son of a bitch, another ray, which means that most of the stuff on the ground here has probably been eaten. It's going to slowly start to regenerate, but it's just... Oh, God. There's an anglerfish right there. I don't know how tough he is compared to, like, our level of toughness. I think... Let me think about this for a second. Do we become an anglerfish after the ray? I almost feel like we do. If we do, we're going to have to stay pretty damn close to the deep side of the ocean over here because I think that, well, I'm pretty sure that the anglerfish, if they don't if they don't get right into the deep side, then they start losing their energy and their have you. They go down pretty damn quick. Ooh, red goo. Oh, I'm going to eat all this red goo. It's so delicious. Give me more. There we go. Oh, shit. All right. Okay. All right there, shark. Now get the fuck off of me. Don't you touch me, shark. Don't you touch me, you scumbag. I don't have time for you. You son of a bitch. Rawr! Grab a couple of these birds. A little bit of a flappy combo there. Not exactly what I was looking for, but whatever. Um, so that's... I don't... I, I didn't look at his name. That's been one of the most annoying bastards we've seen on the server so far, though. I am going to have to, like, keep my eye out for that guy. Ah, the next animal. Yeah, let's go ahead and be an anglerfish. That should be pretty cool. Go over here to the deep area. Now, as an anglerfish, I feel like we are unable to eat the plankton. In fact, I'm pretty sure we can't no matter what. What about this over here? Can we grab these yellow things? No, we can't. So we can only grab the blue chunks. And let's see here. What else? Oh, shit. Whoa. Okay, there we go. So we have the ability here to kind of wave a little object out in front of us. Although it really, I don't think it's going to do very much for us. Because I don't think there's very much down here besides us and, like, more of us. Like, there's a lot of anglerfish down here, and that's about it. Gucci, Gucci, Goo. Anyone want a bite? Anyone want a bite? No, not really. That's fine, though. 
I guess we'll just kind of hang out down here. It's a very solitude down here. You guys know how it is, man. This feels a lot like being a penguin. I will say, though, the anglerfish is very, very freaky. Um, this is just a horrible, horrible looking creature. Uh, oh, what the, look at this right here, boys. Look at this guy. Look at this guy. He was none prepared. Oh, no. Oh, I feel like a son of a bitch. And the problem is, is that our name will forever be ingrained into his browser as the one that did this to him. I don't know, though. Maybe he was, uh... Maybe he was done with the game. He just forgot to log out. Yeah, that's what it was. See, we, we weren't being an asshole or anything like that. It was just it was just the way of it. He was pretty much... He had had enough of deep. He, he decided to log off. It's just he didn't quite get all the way out of the... Oh, who am I saying? I mean, he was probably taking a piss or something like that. And he was like, maybe if I go really, really low, no one will see me. Well, guess what? Gray still plays, CG, you son of a bitch. We're gonna try and get to the leaderboard, too. We're almost there. We're at 100 and... We had 111,000... Uh, experience points right now, so we should be getting there pretty damn soon. The anglerfish. Is it everything you thought it would be? I really don't know what's better. This or the beaver? Probably this? I'm not really sure. Man, this is a really, really narrow area over here. I'm getting kind of claustrophobic. I feel like if you were like a whale or something that could deal with this level of depth, this is where you would hang out because there's not many places a person can run and hide. But you guys saw it here firsthand, man. There's really not that much down here besides us. I do like that there's plenty of these red orbs, though. Man, they definitely give you that big delicious XP chunks. Oh, it's like delicious fishy pizza slices or something. Come here, you red orbs. Oh, and in case you didn't know, if you if you want to know how to, like, turn on your little antenna and stuff like that, you don't, like, press the left or the right mouse click. You just, like, stop. You just stop where you are, kind of put the pointer right on your dude's mouth right there, that big-ass toothy gullet. And it'll turn into uh, the last object that you ate. Someone was saying that if the last object you ate was a fish's piece of meat, that counts. <laughs> so you'll turn into the meat. I think the restriction on sight's pretty damn cool. It's a little disorienting, but it does give the impression of being like in that deep, dark, freakish area with all these prehistoric looking mofos and there have you. The only thing about it, well, the, the anglerfish, I think, gets a 50% bonus to how far they can see. So this little, like, illuminated sphere that's around us, allowing us to see. So everything else can see, like, much less, so to speak. Ooh, we're getting pretty close. 900, 900, yeah, we're almost there. Okay, let's start heading this way. Hold on, let me get a couple of more, couple of more of these. Okay, now we don't want to get anything else here because I think, oh shit, here, hold on. Whoa! Whoa! Oh shit, we're a penguin. We are a freaking penguin. This is a problem. Um, I didn't think about this. We have to go back to our habitat. Uh, and that's gonna be really, really tough. Because the problem is, is that I didn't know that the penguin came after this. And we are way the freaking hell over here. Now, supposedly, you stay invincible until you get back to your habitat. So let's check it out here. We're gonna do a little flippy-do in just a second. Hold on now. Gonna get nice and prepared here. And then we're gonna fly for God and country. Wow, we were way low. Look at how long this takes. And blah, blah, there we go. That'll get us a little bit across. <laughs> oh, shit. All right, that got us a little bit across the map. We're gonna have to go way further than that. Oh, don't you touch me, you scumbag. I'm invincible. Well, I think I'm invincible for the most part. Yeah, I'm invincible. Or at least, I'm invincible to weather effects. Now, it's totally possible that the orca could totally have killed us. I don't know, maybe I was just doing some mad jukes. But it doesn't look like we're able to collect anything, because we can't get anything. And on top of that, it looks like nothing can interact with us. Now, does our boost come back while we're in this form? Because if it does, it would actually be useful to stay in this invulnerable form. There we go. Penguin lives in cold water. There we are. Okay, so now we're in the cold water. But anyway, what I was going to say is it would be useful to stay in this form until you are, until you have your boost back. So oh, here we go. Penguins live in igloos. There you go. So you can hide here now. Well, that's good. Let's go ahead and just hang out for a second. Get our freaking boost backs because I don't know what else is around here. Grace still plays number seven, baby. All right, it was taking too long to get the boost back. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. It was taking too damn long. Now we have to watch out for sea lions. Because I think that the sea lions are the penguins' mortal enemy. And I don't really don't know how many of them there are. Really not that much food around here, man. We can go down here real quick. We can get a little bit of this. But you can see how damn quickly 
the oxygen level kind of goes away right there our temperature's starting to go down as well so we can get a little bit of food and then it's right back up to the mother freaking surface there's a worm right there just kind of looming around how you doing there worm oh shit i just ate the worm i feel really bad about that i did not mean to eat that worm uh because the worm provides us no experience i don't think so that's like like, basically, the only reason to eat, like, the beginning fish or the worms or anything like that is if you're just an asshole. So I feel really bad about that. Hey there, buddy! How's it going? Come here, Pete! Oh, I can't touch you because you're in you're in the, the sad part of the realm. You can't live up here. Whoop! There we go. This is an incredibly rotund penguin. You notice that? Like, our penguin is, like, just freakishly fat. I feel like creatures like this would be much more lithe. Oh, oh, hold on. I think there's a red. Oh, you scumbag other penguin. I hate you so much. Let me get all this. Oh, wow. We're starting to meet up with all kinds of penguins. I mean, I feel bad because they're taking my food from me. But at the same token, like, it's kind of nice to see additional penguins over here for once. So, yeah, life as a penguin, still basically the same, just filled with a little less solitude because there's a few more penguins that hang around with you. I kind of like that grab all this red bull crap right here and plus there is a ton of these golden orbs down here oh they're so good this is making the experience a little bit tolerable we're gonna have to hit those as much as possible let us go back to the surface y'all and get a quick breath of fresh air <sighs> back down we go i am the ultimate life form the penguin the penguin gets the stuff pretty good now, we're not good in this area. Oh, shit. Wow, you, you like, lose real fast in that area. Hold on. I, I might actually have to boost over here. I got kind of worried. Holy crap. Like, the temperature goes down real fast as a penguin. I had no idea it was quite that fast. Well, I probably... Oh, shit. Oh, shit. All right. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Whoa. All right. We almost, we almost ran out of oxygen. Now, if I remember correctly... I mean, I don't remember if you just take damage or if you, like, insta-die if you run out of oxygen. Ooh. 16% left, boys. We're almost there. This is it in just a moment. We will be vastly more powerful than before. 3%. Hold on. Let me get let me get another just quick gulp of oxygen. Might as well real fast. And we'll kind of finish things up here in just a second. 2%. Pretty much if I find anything, we're going to get there. But, uh, 50, 44. Oh, yeah. We're done. Here we go. So now we can choose the next animal. You got that. You got that. You, what the hell is this? Is that, what is that, a regular shark? And then you got this thing over here? I don't know, let's be this. There we go, what the hell is this? You are a leopard seal. Great. As fast as a penguin, but deadlier. Wow. It's just a slightly better penguin. What the crap? So, can we sit up here? Oh, we can! What a horrible, horrible looking entity. It's like, oh, what the fuck? What the hell? What just beat the shit out of me? Was it the little worm? Did that little worm just whoop my ass? Son of a bitch. I can't believe this. Oh, no. Oh, wow. We can't eat any of that? That sucks. Are we also... Do we also have a problem with the temperature? Yeah, we sure do. Well, isn't that something else? So, basically, what we have to do then... We can't eat any of the plankton on the ground, or whatever you want to call it. We can't eat any of that. So, effectively, what we have to do is eat fucking penguins. Like, these guys right over here. Look at this scumbag right over here. We have to eat him. That's what we have to do. Oh, it's penguin on penguin action, boys. Here we go. This is what it all comes down to. That penguin's trying to get away. That penguin's trying to get away, but he don't, he don't stand a chance. Oh, he went to his friggin' igloo. You suck-ass penguin. I hate you so much. How about, how about you? How about you, buddy? You want a piece? I can grab your ass real quick. Actually, that sounded really bad. Come here, penguin. It's okay, lols. I do it for the lols. I know how it is. Come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. Come here. Yo! Oh, 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 God! Oh, I feel so bad. Leopard seal versus penguin. Who's going to win? The leopard seal, boys. Whoa, leopard seal on leopard seal action. All right, now there's two of us over here. Oh, all the hunt for Red October begins. Come here, penguin, you son of a bitch. I've got something to show you. It's my powerful leopard seal wiener. Where the hell are you? There he is. There's a penguin right there. Look at him run. Look at him run in fear. Come here, penguin. Come here, penguin. Oh, you can't run now, can you? Can't run now, can you, you scumbag? Oh, oh, here we go, here we go. Here we go, boom. Oh, we're getting him. We're getting him, boys. He's trying to evade. He's trying to evade, but he's gonna need a boost. He's gonna need a boost, otherwise he's fucked. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, no. Oh, you scumbag. Yes. Ooh, we're a killer whale now. 
Holy shit! Ooh. And killer whales seem to be able to do just fine over here. In the cold lands. Really? Oh, we're level four now, too. Oh, we just ate all the people. Oh, we just ate all the people. Killer whale is the latest animal. We're the most powerful creature in the world now. But we're only level, we're only rank four. Oh, oh, come here, buddy. Come here. Yeah. Yes, come with me, my child. I love eating you. It really doesn't do very much, though. Like, we have to essentially... Oh, right over here, right over here. Oh, 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 you do. You do, killer, killer seal or whatever the hell you are. Your ass is mine. Come here, buddy. Come here, Arth. I ain't got time for your bullshit. You know you can't, you know you can't survive over here in the not in the warmth or can you i really don't know maybe you can oh there's little dudes over here as well look there's a beaver over here fucking hate beavers oh you're gonna die so slow beaver why oh, don't you run from me well this is it guys this is uh, the pinnacle of uh pinnacle of evolution over here we've got uh got a beaver just kind of wandering around got some people here that we can eat now and again slurp right there and uh, i'd like to at least get to number three on the board here so let's try for that oh Whoa, we got a shark over here. Looks like the shark doesn't want a piece of us. That's interesting. Huh. It's life as an orca, boys. Life as an orca. Basically, you just kind of wander around and eat human beings. Really, There's really not much else. Oh, shit. We got a whale right there. It's up there, whale. Don't you fuck with me. I'm an orca, all right? I don't have time for your BS. I have I have the power of, of, of greatness on me, okay? Get away from me, you son of a bitch. I, I need to eat these people, okay? I don't have time. I don't have time for whale problems, all right? You go do something else. Go get that friggin, go get that friggin crab over there. Oh, we've got someone. We've got a scumbag, boys. We've got a scumbag. Arr, come here, you son of a bitch. Come here. Come here. Yes. Oh, we got him. Oh, we got him good. I think that was, what the hell was that? Was that a, uh, was that a, oh, shit, I never remember. Not a ray, it's the other one. I know you guys are telling, uh, uh, squid? Was that a squid? Ooh, there's human beings over here. I love eating human beings. Oh, shit, a whale. Oh, a beaver, boys! Oh, that beaver got out of here in a freaking hurry. Oh, God. Oh! <laughs> Get eaten, fool! That was pretty good. But uh, some of the unnames are like leveling up their experience really, really fast. Like really, really fast. I don't know if I can keep up with. It. I don't know if I can keep up with that level. We'll try and eat a couple more people, and see where it gets us. Oh, look at this meat just hanging out. What? what where, where did that go? Oh, beaver! Oh, beaver! Come here, beaver! Come here, beaver! Yes, it's beaver time, boys. Come here, beaver. Come on down with old Gray. I've got something to show you. I have such wonderful things to show you, Beaver. Don't you run from me, you little furry bastard. Come here. All right, you can go. I saw something else cool over here. I think it just went soaring past me. Oh, we got number three. Yay. We got number three. Should we go for number two? I don't know if I have the patience for go to go for number two. I'm going to try and eat. We'll try and eat someone else. Oh, we got them, boys. Here we go. Oh, shit. We're going we're gonna to die if we don't get some something to... If we don't get a little bit of air here. All right, there we go. Uh, come on. Let me... Come here, buddy. Come here. Come here. Come here. No, no, no. Don't you run from me. Don't you run from me, you scumbag. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here, you whore. Come here. No, the fucking beaver got in the way. Get out of the way, beaver, you son of a bitch. Oh, this guy's right there. We don't have enough boost to get him, though. Come on. Come on. Oh, he's healed. Oh, look at this. More meat hanging out in the middle of nowhere. Where does meat come from? Wow, look at all these people. Holy crap. Oh, wow. We found like the freaking smorgasbord of human beings. That was really good. We got nudged out of uh, third place. Whoever whoever that other unnamed person is, they are getting experience like awesomely fast. I can't believe. Whoa. That was interesting. Uh, I didn't quite mean to fly quite that far. Look out there, little fish. I have no interest in plebeians such as you. I want tasty penguins. Ooh, or tasty crabs. Tasty crabs are good too. I have so much trauma from being a penguin that I feel like F-bombing a few of them. Now I wonder where it went. There was a penguin over there. I think it's gone now. We've got this whale kind of following us. I don't really I don't really like that much though. So I think we're gonna go ahead and uh, springboard into the stratosphere here. Grab a couple of flappy birds while we're at it. Got a good five of them right there. All right, I think that's it for now. We managed to evolve pretty damn quick. 
And we've got, we've got, we ended up getting quite a few tender morsels of flesh under our belt. We screwed over quite a few people, which means that this particular play session of Deep was a success. And we got to see some of the new critters too, which I'm pretty happy about. Wow. And now that I'm kind of hanging out over here, we're killing all of the people. How, how is that person just floating through the air? Wow. Look at that Flappy combo right there. Flappy Bird combo times 10. That's what I'm talking about. Anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed this episode of Deep. Until next time, folks, stay foxy and much love.